Baby, I've been searching like everybody else Can't say nothing different about myself Sometimes I'm an angel and sometimes I'm cruel And when it comes to love, I'm just another fool Yes, I'll climb a mountain I'm gonna swim the sea There ain't no act of God, girl Could keep you safe from me My arms are reaching out Out across this canyon I'm asking you to be my true companion <laughs> Can I touch her? Yeah, you can touch her <laughs> So don't you dare try to walk away. Wow. I got my heart set on our wedding day. That's beautiful. I've got this vision of a girl in white. Made my decision and it's you. When I take your hand, I watch my heart set sail. I'll take my trembling fingers And I'll lift up your veil Then I'll take you home And with wild abandon Crystal, when I met you, I was in a really bad place, but nobody knew it. I knew that even though I was not where God wanted me, He had not given up on me. I know it's because God sent you to me. He knew what I needed. He knew the one thing he could use to bring me back to him. It's been a long road for both of us since we met over seven years ago. We've been through some extreme ups and downs from the most incredible trips to Paris to me almost dying in front of your eyes. From almost creating a life together to almost departing from each other forever. But God knew what we both needed. All it took was for us to listen. So in order to give thanks to God for saving not only my physical life, but more importantly sending you to save me spiritually, I make the following vow to you, my wife. I, Rob Pappas, promise to love you, Crystal, as Christ loved his church and gave his life for her. Until the room grows dark Then when I leave this earth I'll be with the angels standing I'll be out there waiting for my true companion Just for my true companion True companion True companion Rob, I promise to love you above all others and to value our friendship as a precious gift. I look forward to being leaders for our children and grandchildren in building our relationship under the care and guidance of God. I promise to stand beside you in sickness and in health, in times of prosper and decline, in peace and in turmoil, as long as we both shall live.
when I first met Crystal through my dad. Um, it's actually, my, I got the phone call from my dad being in Florida, and we're gonna hang out at the Celtic Ray, and I'm gonna meet some of his friends. Um, you know, being, being my father's son, obviously it's, it's strange the first time you meet a, a girlfriend that your dad's dating, and I was skeptical. Um, obviously, me and my Jenny got the invite, and we were both kind of connived on what we were going to do. So we get there at the Celtic Ray, fashionably late in the Pappas Manor. <laughs> and we go up to the top floor of the Celtic Ray, and we see them on the bottom. They don't even know we're there yet. So I have a great idea of uh, chomping up some ice and spitting it through a, chaw, a straw at my dad. And him being the tipsy uh, public goer like he is, um, had no idea what was going on, so that was fun. Eventually, I got tired of bugging my dad from afar and joined him, and then he introduced us to Crystal. I had initially planned on being kind of dismissive, like, eh, you know, whatever. And uh, okay, Crystal being Crystal made it too difficult, really, to be me. With her high, high energy. You know, Pappas aren't always keen on change. Um, Pappas aren't always keen on change, despite this, Crystal has always been persistent to really get to know me, my family, my dad's kids, and really try to be part of their lives. Um, once I met Crystal's children, I knew she had to be doing something right, because her kids truly represent a brightness that have that she has shared with me. Her family was wonderful, and, and for that, so I thank you, Crystal, for being a part of our family and allowing us to be a part of yours. Um, to my dad, he isn't the easiest person to love sometimes, but I couldn't imagine life without him. It sounds cliche, but you know, I know he has my back. And if something were to ever happen to me, he would take care of my family, and that's really all you can, a man can ask for. So thank you, Dad, sincerely. Okay, how's everybody doing so far? First, I would like to congratulate my beautiful daughter, Crystal, and her new husband, Dr. Robert Pappas. And Rob, I want to invite you to my family. But open up, but open up. My son in law, father in law. <laughs> so again, oh, one more thing. When Rob used to come to me, he used to love the sequel in me. Every time he comes to me, I have to make sure Rob, I lost this. Connie's favorite seafood chowder. <laughs> Clients and all the rest of that seafood in me. And Rob used to love that. Still and you still do. Still does. <laughs> so again, congratulations to both of you. God bless you and I love you both. Aww. I think there are some of you here who have just met Crystal. And there are some of you here who have just met Rob. It's kind of amazing when two absolutely incredible people come together. There are many things in life that measure wealth. Some people think wealth is measured with money. I don't think so, really. Although it's a good barometer sometimes. Some people think that life is measured with health. Well, Rob and Crystal will tell you that by that measure, that's a pretty important item. These two people have shown all of us that they embody the meaning of faith. Faith in God, faith in each other, faith in their family and friends. You know, when I happen to be, I don't know how many of you would know this, but I happen to be Jewish. And in the Jewish tradition, there's a word called Bershed. It's, the definition of Bershed is meant to be. 
And when you find your bershed, you know that it's a forever relationship. Well, my friend Rob, who seven years ago said to me, oh, you gotta meet this amazing girl I just met, said, I, I, think, I think she's the woman. And I said, really, that's interesting. Well, I said to him at that time, and I'm gonna say it again, I think crystals, you're per shed. You're meant to be. Each of these two amazing people have saved each other. They've illustrated what true wealth really is. And they've made all of us envy them and their love. May your love go on forever and ever. I know that it will. May your family share nachas, which is joy. All right? And may you live long and healthy lives surrounded by all the people you love. Congratulations.